I'm live. Hey guys, it's Jessica, the furry family coach, and my arm is not very long, so um, I don't know how much you can see behind me. I've got this really cool like live effect going on. I don't know if I can switch it. I don't know. Um, and take it off. There. Okay, I got it to go off. Anyway, <laughs> so uh, I just wanted to come on here. It is, you know, the holiday season, whatever holiday you may be celebrating this time of year. Um, today is, I think, the winter solstice. It's the longest day of the, or I'm sorry, the shortest day of the year. So after today, um, our days start getting longer. We get a little bit more sunlight every day from here until um, summer. So that's exciting. And I just wanted to come on here. There are so many holiday tips and I wanted to give you guys one right now um, for your dogs and even uh, those of you with cats. I know cats can be just as inquisitive and um, snooping <laughs> as a lot of dogs can. So um, you can see behind me I've got my Christmas tree. Well, I actually have a couple of Christmas trees. Um, I'm getting ready to put up my fourth tree today in my cat room and I have waited kind of to the last minute to put it up in their room, but I have three trees in my house, one in my office, two that you see behind me in my living room. There's actually my angel tree, if you can see that. I have a bunch of like homemade uh, ornaments of my pets that have passed away and my dad who passed away, my grandfather who passed away. And um, so that's, you know, my angel tree there. But the tip I wanted to give you guys today, and for some of you watching, this may be really obvious. And for um, some of you, you may be like, oh yeah, like I didn't, I know this, but I didn't think about it. And then um, guys, there are so many people that don't think about this at all. So I'm gonna really ask you to, um, you know, let your friends in on this, let your friends and family in on this tip because they may not be thinking about it. And the holidays this time of year, is one of the, um, when emergency vet hospitals have some of uh, the most cases they see all year long of chocolate toxicity in dogs. And here is a perfect example. So I'm gonna see if I can show you. Do you see that right back there? Those are some, whoop, oh no. I twisted my camera. How do I get my camera back? I don't know, guys. Oh, I might have to end this video and get my camera back. Ah! We'll go this way and see if that works. Oh, there's some um, chocolate, chocolate Christmas tree cakes under the tree. Oh my goodness. Guess what? They should not be there. They should not be there. So, let's see. If I can turn my camera again. I don't know how I changed the angle on my camera. Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's see how I can get in the frame. <laughs> um... Anyway, so here's what I want to tell you. Let me go back this way so you can at least see some Christmas tree. Some Christmas tree there. Oh, gracious. All right. Well, I don't know how to fix this, guys. So um, I'm just going to, here, I'm just going to turn this around again and let you see my Christmas tree while I'm talking to you. So, um, don't, don't. Chocolate is one of the most, um, popular gifts to give at Christmas time. And I'm going to show you again. One of the most popular gifts to give at Christmas time is chocolate. So if you have any chocolates that you're giving to friends or family and you have them wrapped up, don't put them under the Christmas tree. Um, put them somewhere out of reach of your dogs and cats because this is one of the most popular times of year, emergency vet visits um, for chocolate toxicity in dogs. And 
Um, one of the other tips that I wanted to give you guys outside of you not putting the chocolates under your Christmas tree is to any, if you're, if you're taking your dog over to friends or family's house, before you go, give them a heads up and say, Hey, you know, I'm bringing my dog. I just want to make sure you don't have any chocolates wrapped up under the Christmas tree. If you do, could you please pick them up and, you know, put them in a closet or, um, you know, on top of your, uh, refrigerator or whatever, you know, just to get them out of the way and uh, make sure that your dog doesn't get into them. So I'm really sorry about this camera issue, guys. Um, and I, I, I will do better. I will do much better on my next live video. So for now, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video and please, please, please um, share the information. Don't wrap up chocolates and put them under the Christmas tree. If you think you're going to, you know, wrap them up and put them away somewhere and you're going to forget about them, like put a little note card or something, a Christmas card or something under your Christmas tree that um, says, hey, you know, grab the the gift for so-and-so uh, and wherever you put it. So with that, guys, I will see you next time and I will make sure... Um, not to do whatever I did with the camera this time. So I will talk to you guys later.